Olympia Vale is a standout even among the unique experiences of her squad mates. While capable in the field, it was not where Vale's military career began. Born on January 20th in 2536 on the colony of Luten, Vale from an early age was shown to be quite a prodigy, particularly when it came to languages. When Vale was 11, her mother, a Navy Signal Intelligence Officer, was transferred to Earth. On the way, their ship's slipspace drive malfunctioned, turning a six-day trip into a six-month limp towards inhabited space while dodging Covenant activity. Vale, a curious child, quickly annoyed the other passengers with her endless questions and was shunted to the side. To pass time, she began listening to recordings of the Sangheili language and comparing them to AI translations. It wasn't long before she picked up the language, even correcting the AI translations. Vale would go on to attend Sydney University and later, following in her mother's footsteps in signal intelligence, she enlisted with Oni. Following the end of the Human Covenant War, Vale found the opportunity to study the Sangheili in much more depth, traveling around Sangheili space and visiting their colonies. At one point, she spent months wandering the colony of Kale Mothka, a world embroiled in the Sangheili Civil War, though she quickly learned how to avoid trouble. By 2555, Vale was serving as a diplomat and Sangheili culture and language expert. Her expertise was highly valued during UEG negotiations with the Arbiter's emerging Swords of Sangheilios faction. In March of 2555, Vale was recruited as part of Operation Farstorm. The Halo Array was on a countdown to activation and a joint UNSC Sangheili task force was assembled to find a way to end the threat. Vale's mastery of the Sangheili language and culture was seen as a necessity in dealing with the Sangheili forces sent by the Arbiter. During their mission to the Ark, Vale was captured by the installation's monitor, 000 Tragic Solitude. However, by engaging it in conversation, she was able to buy time for other forces to locate her, stop the crazed monitor, and deactivate the Halo Array. Following the mission to the Ark, Vale found herself unsatisfied with her former routine. Looking for more, she entered the UNSC War Games, an inter-service competition that utilized technology similar to the War Games simulator used by Spartan Force. Despite her relative inexperience, Vale placed in the top 5%. This, and Oni's recommendation, was enough for the Spartan 4 branch to recruit her. Now, in late 2558, Spartan Vale has been recruited as part of Fireteam Osiris, tasked with hunting down the rogue blue team, where her expertise on Sangheili culture and language will undoubtedly prove valuable in their hunt. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you liked this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up, subscribing, and sharing it around. You are the reason I get to keep doing this, so thank you, profusely thank you. If you want to dive deeper into Halo's lore, head over to the Halo Archive. It's a lore-based community that welcomes everyone from experts to rookies. No matter what your working knowledge, you'll be sure to find a friend and a good time.